scrap mechanic logic can become really messy. The problem that you got is you wouldn't know what some of these things were unless you took away your connection tool because that connection dot is so big. I'm going to show you how you can change that into something a little bit different. For example, if you wanted something, some arrows, or just in general, something that's just a lot simpler and a lot smaller to see. It's very easy, but you do have to do some file digging. First things first, you need to go into Steam, Steam Apps, Common, find your Scrap Mechanic game, Scrap Mechanic, go into Data, go into Textures, and go into Connection Tool. Once you're in here, the one that you're looking for is this motorpoint.png. Open this up in your program of choice, and it comes up with something a little bit like this. All we've got is a simple circle. Now you'll see that this is white and it's got a clear background. Whatever you do here, you have to keep it white. We'll use the rubber. What's gonna happen is what you see white is what will show on your connection tool. I'm gonna thin this down into a weird little mess of a dot, really, just so you can see how janky it is and then we're going to save this and then we're just going to save over that motor point png and just replace it boom that's that bit next what you need to do so this is where things are going to get a little bit tricky in your scrap mechanic file you got to go to your cache in your cache you got to go to textures in your textures you need to find that motor point now luckily it's all in alphabetical order or you can use a search right here motor point delete that boom now you have to close down scrap mechanic completely you've then got to reopen the game when you reopen the game it's kind of got to build that cache a little bit sometimes it takes a little while now if i jump into this test it should be putting me in front of my logic uh, pull out my connection tool and you'll see that great big mess that i've literally just created in photoshop so here we go go to the connection tool and as you can see that weird little splodge that we just created that is there if you want to change this you will not do anything until the game updates so remember you've got to close out the game completely i'm just going to go into photoshop grab me a little circle where's this down here boom go center that's the center easy enough we're going to turn off that layer so we've got a tiny little dot i'm going to save this save the motor point png then we've got to go into the cache find that motor point delete that file boom Start up Scrap Mechanic. Once Scrap Mechanic is started up, we can go into our survival world, have a look, see? And we should have a tiny little dot now. There we go, a tiny little dot. You can do whatever you want to do to that as long as whatever it is that you do do is white and you'll be able to see it. If I really wanted to, I could get a text, put a giant W because that's who I am. Save as that PNG. And then if we get the connection tool, boom. We've now got a little W. Hope that helps everybody. If it does, you appreciate it. It's easier to see your logic this way. You see things a lot, lot better. You know what you're connecting to. Pretty awesome. Cheers, guys. Take it easy. Bye for now. Bye, everybody.